Hey there everybody, I'm back, and I haven't quite finished, obviously you can see I've carved out this whole top floor, I suppose is what I want to call this, and I've opened up this, obviously I've carved out a lot, ran into a few more uh, stone monsters, <laughs> uh, those little, little bed bugs. Um, but they weren't too big of a problem. And I've kind of decided I like to open up these sides here. Uh, specifically those two blocks. Right like that. I just want that block and uh, kind of get a uh, nice little corner view right out, you know, into the solar system. Uh, and obviously, <laughs> as you can, you probably have noticed already, my well, my food meter's very low, <laughs> and um, but. If I'm not mistaken, you can't die from hunger uh, in any of the regular modes. I think it's only hardcore core mode where you die, do die of hunger. I mean, I could go and test that. Um, or I, could, I could look it up, I suppose, but no sense in uh, wasting your guys' time doing that. I could be doing this. <laughs> Opening up this window. <laughs> you can see there, out of the corner of my eye, that that looks interesting. That looks dangerous. Hmm. But, uh, I wanted to give you guys an update, and because my health is getting so low, I've decided to, uh, you know, it, I'm, if I die, that's okay. I'm not playing hardcore. So obviously I'll just spawn back up here. Right up around here. Uh, hopefully, you actually, let's move this tree. I'd hate to, uh... Oh, no, it won't do anything, will it? It'll just spawn me somewhere else. But, um... What I think I'm gonna do is go ahead, and for safety's sake, after I found a few more bits of iron, I'm gonna take... Oh, oh, this is, uh... So this is, this is source blocks of water. Is that right? Yeah, these are, yeah, these are source blocks. Yeah, but that's really neat. I'm going to go ahead and, what I'm going to do is move this somewhere. I'm going to, here, here, yeah, here will work. Let's get my torch first. Because I'm going to make an infinite water source. Somewhere a little bit, a little bit more. Safe. I mean, I've got this infinite here, but I'd like to get rid of it so I can kind of clean this up. For now. So... Now that I've got that infinite water down there. Goodness, there's water sources everywhere. Go ahead and clean 
clean up this dirt. You can stay up here. That one I took off the rest of the moon. It just looked silly. I wanted to get rid of it. That was really the only purpose behind destroying that. And I do like to keep my symmetry. I do like to do that. Fine. So actually, it's three. Oh, that goes all the way across over there. Oh well, it's fine. It's not a big deal. But what I figured is I'm gonna take. Better leave my bucket of water and my iron. And my iron pickaxe. I can always come back if there's diamond. Um, but since it's my very little amount of iron, I'm also going to leave quite a bit of my dirt. I'm going to swap out these stacks of wood. Um, and as you can see, I've collected quite a bit of cobblestone, but I'm it's boring. It's boring down there, just clearing out. Uh, <clears throat> clearing out cobblestone, looking for one or two bits of iron. So I'm going to take... Yeah, that's probably way more than enough. And... Ooh. Actually, I'm going to test something. Okay. So it doesn't drop me. That's good. That's the important part. I'm going to go ahead and start. Torches, so die. That's all right. We'll come right back. <laughs> so I guess in hard as well. Now, oh, oh my, oh my. Why does it do that? I just get thrown. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this stuff in. I'm, I'm gonna, I've got to see what that was. It's the craziest thing. I, I mean, I think whenever something spawns into the world, it creates that puff of smoke. So I think that was me spawning that made that little... smoke ball. Gosh. I don't know where my, my other pick went. Hmm. This could put a damper on my plans. But anyway. See, I don't want to lose any of this stuff. Let's make another chest. Much simpler. And I want, I mean, uh, 
so much for the experience. I doubt I'm going to have any chance to get any... Oh. Any chance to, uh... What am I thinking? To, uh... Retrieve... Any obsidian, so... I don't think I should be concerned about... The... Enchantments. Because I doubt I'll ever even get the opportunity to use them. Um... Maybe there's there might be an enchantment table hidden somewhere, but and yeah, that, that's experience is pretty pretty easy to come by. So I'm not I'm not too worried about it. Uh, let's just Sun's nice and high in the sky. And the sun. <laughs> uh, that's kind of odd. Talk about breaking the immersion. Should be nighttime all the time. I wonder if you could. Well, you probably have to have a mod you have to have installed to do that. Oh, there's a chest. So it looks like a nice little fall. That's okay. I figure I can do... Actually, I don't know why I keep going this way. I'm going to jump down. Not dig myself down, but see if I can... Ugh, well. It's okay. It's just a little bit of fall damage. Oh, it's scary down there. Ooh. Ow. Ah, yellow wool. Hmm. So far, this hasn't been... I think... They can be disguised. <laughs> so far, this hasn't been that difficult of a... Wool challenge, has it? But, uh, maybe it's just... Maybe I'm just that good. No, that's a, that's a lie. That's a... That's a mass... That's a, that's a very much a falsification. <laughs> oh, oh, gosh. <laughs> uh, that wouldn't have been that bad, but... Still would have been a pain. And I really don't want things spawning on here. Because I get the feeling I'm going to end up traveling along this back and forth quite a bit. Uh, what with falling and all that fun stuff. But let's go ahead and place this wool, store the rest somewhere safe. Hmm. Very odd. I don't. Usually they're in order, but maybe they're not. Uh, his his uh, objectives aren't in order, so why would his wools be? Hmm? I don't. I don't know. Just making assumptions. And you know what they say about assumptions.